Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Andy Rich and welcome back to Tears of the Kingdom. So, plan for this episode, I think. We have just obtained the map for Central Hyrule. And I think I kind of want to get some shrines done. So we have this Kayanonis Kai shrine over here that we're going to head to. Um, we're going to clear that. And then we're going to explore Central Hyrule a little more. So yeah, I'll see you when we get to the shrine. All right, here we are. In the central square of Hyrule Field, we have the Kayanonis Shrine. I think I'm saying that right. Kayanonis, surely that is correct. This is the first shrine that we are doing outside of the four OG ones in the Great Sky Island or whatever that island was called. I'm excited. Um, I really, I kind of like the shrine format. I, I know a lot of people aren't the biggest fans of it, but I like it. I like the puzzles. I like making my brain work a little bit. So yeah, we'll have to see what exactly Tears of the Kingdom Shrines are all about. If this is going to be easy peasy lemon squeezy or difficult, difficult, lemon difficult. Combat. Oh, ain't no way. Is this a minor test of strength we have going on here? Rusty, ugh, I don't need that crap. Square up, brother. Let's go. Oh, you are a lot bigger than I thought you were going to be. A minor test of strength? This shrine purifies the ancient evil. You have entered here. Heed my instruction. Use a side hop to avoid enemy attacks. This will create an opening that you can use to strike back. Oh, it's teaching me how to do the do the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. So first, I do not want to use this stone axe. Let's use this Boko Reaver, shall we? Okay, buddy. Boom! And we get the flare. Uh, 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 uh. Bam! Do a backflip to avoid enemy attacks and create an opening to strike back. On it, boss. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, my timing. Okay, the timing's very forgiving. Wait. Interesting. I need to actually avoid the swing. Interesting. So I, I don't even really need to jump over the... I don't even really need to jump over the weapon. I just need to time it somewhat right. It's pretty forgiving. Ready shield and press A to parry. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, good try. Ow. A quarter HP. Yeah, I'm doing it too early. Let me cook, let me cook. Sheesh! Dang. Build up your power, then release it to unleash a charge attack. Catch your enemies in this motion to damage them. Press and hold and release. Okay, it's teaching me the nuances of combat. Oh, you are dead, sir. Good riddance. Your master of these techniques has earned you access. Proceed within. Big shrine clear. Should we just grind? I think we're just gonna grind out the central Hyrule shrines, guys. I think we do it. Uh, I need to... Relax. We're gonna drop the old wooden bow, pick up this construct bow, pick up this zonai charge, leave the rusty broadsword, cause it sucks. And what is our reward? It would be really sad if we got the Hylian armor for free after spending it. Zonite sword. A sword made of zonite. It resonates with zonite devices to slightly increase its attack power. It resonates with attached zonite devices to slightly increase its attack power. Uh, goodbye, board guster. Hello, zonite sword. Complete this and get our spirit orb. What is it called in this game? Oh my, I am... I am see-through. It's because it's so green in here, so it's making my shirt see-through because it's just white. That's hilarious. Am I fixed? Shut up. Yeah, it looks like it's good now. It, it figured out what was going on with my shirt. Good work. Good work, webcam. You did great, sweetie. Yeah, yeah. Blessing of light, blah, blah, blah. So I have one of those now, and I need three more in order to 
uh, get my, in order to, what am I saying? I need three more in order to upgrade my health. Also, these act as teleport places now, I believe. So like I can teleport here, yeah. So definitely useful. Um, so I think what we're gonna do now is we're gonna head over, rip. We're gonna head over to the tower. We're gonna jump high up in the sky. And then we are going to um, mark off shrine locations and make sure that we're getting every single shrine location perfectly. Yo! It's a freaking pelican man! Pen, well look at this. You're the one I saw flying around in the sky. It's great to meet the first one to ever be launched from a Skyview Tower. A real historic moment. Hey, what's your name? My name's Link. Link, you say? Hold on there. Really? Your name is Link? Hey, buddy. <laughs> You got the same name as that famous swordsman. Ha, <laughs> good for you. Pretty big name to live up to, though. Oh. I'm Penn, by the way. I work for the Lucky Clover Gazette. I'm writing an article about this event, so folks everywhere will know about the Skyview Towers being activated. I'd better get to work. Our newspaper is short on staff, so I've had to flap all over the place to cover the news. Hey, we could use another reporter. You should join us. Seem like a brave type and all. That's what it takes. Ah. Our newspaper is based in Hebra, to the northwest. You'll find it near the bridge that leads to Rito Village. Stop by if you're up for the adventure of a lifetime in the newspaper biz. Until then, soar long! Oh boy, I like him. Seems like a nice guy. Okay, let's launch ourselves here. Now, while we are high up in the sky, we are going to pull out our... Oh, this is... This is a lot. This is a lot to take in. Uh, what button is it to pull up my pro pad? Oh, no, no, that's not what I wanted. No, that's not what I wanted either. No. How do I pull up my pro pad? I, I don't think I can actually while I'm in the sky. Okay, well, I see, I see, I see one over there. I see one over there. So we got one there and one there. So let's make our way down into the depths. Hey, it's not your fault. You, you did, you, you're doing fine, sweetie. The Geosin Shrine. Allons-y. That is French for let's go. So what's cooking in this shrine? I want the last shrine was basically just a tutorial, which is fine, I guess, but I would like to do a real shrine. Give me some challenges, game. Shape rotation. The Geosin Shrine. Okay, I'm liking what I'm seeing so far. I see, so we have to use our Ultra Hand ability here. So this is nice and easy because it's already in the right shape. So that was nice and easy, but I'm we're probably gonna get some more difficult ones and I'm assuming we're gonna use this as a bridge Yes, first are there any secrets down here? I need to be made aware of No, okay. Thank you for your time Let's Perfect Jump that gap mind the gap Awesome, okay, so now we got several openings here and by several I mean two there's also if you look to your right, a treasure chest. Also, I figured out how to use the pearl pad. I've remembered. This is an interesting development. What is what is going on here? Can I? I cannot climb this. Okay. So maybe we have to go to the other side? Yeah, yeah there's something cooking over here. Come here, you. So we have to turn this to make it fit. Yeah? Oh yeah, easy does it. Uh, let's make this, let's put this right here so I can, oh, pardon me, my bad. Can I not climb this? Oh, so maybe we need to put it, hold on, let's get this rotation correct here. Boom. There. 
Nailed it. Oh. <laughs> Kinda nailed it. There. Now we nailed it. Sir. Surely you could get... Yeah, okay. Come on, buddy. The Hero of Time... Uh... Okay. The Hero of Time has not trapped themselves on this day, thankfully. That would be embarrassing. And we get up here and get this coveted treasure, which is... An awesome... Hasty Elixir. Grants a mid-level haste effect while boosting your movement speed... Which, which boosts your movement speed while running, swimming, or climbing. Okay, that could come in handy. Seems like a very versatile piece of equipment here. Ah, I see. And now we need to find a rotation that fits. So I think I'm going to have to go like this. But then probably put it on a diagonal? No, hold on. Yeah, there we go. Uh, a little bit of a tight squeeze, but we made it work. Oh, pardon me. Now, I just put you guys conveniently in a way, not that way, probably this way. Like this. Then I go hop, hop, hop. Can I make this? Hop. Nope, I cannot make this. Okay, so we need to put the... Hello? We need to put the... I think maybe if we flip it around 180 degrees, like this. Yeah, there we go. This is perfect. Oh, narrator, it was not perfect. Can we still make this work? Can we cheese it with the diagonal? Oh, come on, Link. Get it together, big man. This is surely how I'm supposed to do it, right? No, no, no. Do I have to like... Do I have to rest it semi on that? What if I did this? Jump, 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 jump. Yeah, there we go, lads. Another shrine easily conquered by this intelligent, handsome YouTuber. We get ourselves another light of blessing. You need to start getting used to saying that because that, that is the thing that I get. Boom, another shrine complete. Okay, here we are. What is the name of this shrine game? It is the... Why am I not getting a prompt? The Sus... Sus Shrine. Susu... Susuyai. It's just the Sus Shrine. Like, how could it be anything other than that? There is a shrine among us. A Sus Shrine. Very sus. This is sus. A spinning device, the Sus Shrine. I see a chest. Um, can I? Come here, you. Oh. Oh my gosh. Uh. Uh. Okay. Uh, oh my gosh, <laughs> what have I done? I'm sorry. Oh no, I've ruined it. It was all in such a perfect pattern and now everything is going terribly. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I am the sus imposter. It's me, it was me the whole time. All that for five arrows. I've destroyed the balance of this. Here, please. Oh no, this is terrible. Let me, let me help you with that. Here, continue, see look, it's normal, continue on. There, look, see, everything's fine. Come here, sir. Yeah, there, yeah, see guys, look. No, no, no harm, no foul. 
Go on your way, friends. So do they go up or down? They go down and then like respawn or something? Interesting. So it looks like I'm gonna need to take one of these. And use it to get up this ramp. Huh! Yeah, you're, you're doing great. Keep it up, buddy. Nice work. Love that. And looky here, we've got the spinning device. And let me guess it'll close. Yeah, so here, bud. Your next task. Spin this for me. Thank you. I don't know if that's how that was supposed to go, but that's how it went. All right, so we got two. Okay, car, can you stop slamming the door, please? We got one of these bad boys here, and we got... So do I need to go like this and attach it to the underside? No. How can I make this go? Oh, do I have to, hold on. Do I have to put it up front? Like here. If I, so if I flip it over like this uh, attach now there's a new way to activate it and shoot with an arrow does that activate it oh wait that's uh, the arrow the arrow thank you arrow that was very kind of you to point out my folly Let's do a full 180 turn slide this bad boy in here attach So I am now realizing that the arrow was not the direction it would take me. It is the direction that uh, the tire spins. Good to know that this has been a learning experience that I really appreciated. Thank you, game. Oh, and now I see why it was giving me the five arrows in case I was some, here we go. In case I was some dude who didn't have a single arrow in my inventory because I somehow used them all. And just like that, we have gamed our way through another shrine. Would you expect anything less? I wouldn't, because I am a shrine genius. Shrine genius destroys shrines, not clickbait. That will be the title of this video. I'll probably forget though, and just make it something else. Okay, so we have three shrines down. One, two, three. Last shrine that I have pinned out is way on over here. So we're gonna teleport to the Kyanosis shrine and make our way over there. Trust in it. Oh, an ambush. Ah, my traveler's shield broke. Uh, shield. Very awesome. 20? Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, we'll pick up a 20 level thing. Uh, goodbye minecart hammer. Hello, Bokoblin arm. And I think we'll drop a couple more things. Goodbye, traveler's sword. Hello, Bokoblin arm. Got some Bokoblin horns. Oh, that dude's about to zap, but we're, we're fine with that. We, we don't want it anymore, so it's all good. So if I drop a, like if I drop one of these, and then I put, can I fuse these with this? Where's fuse? Fuse. <laughs> Huh. 
That is awesome. I have a 25, level 25 sword. Oh, what on me is metal? Hello? Ah, my, my shield, I see. Well, let's equip a non-metal one then, shall we? Something else is zapping. Some, some sort of shield. We're fine with that. We, we, we don't need to mess with that, do we? No, not at all. This is in our... Yeah, okay. We, we, we just have travel a long ways. I'm not used to Breath of the Wild's travel... Or, Tears of the Kingdom's travel time. Okay, we marked off another shrine on our map. What about that one right there? Surely this one is too far, right? It's not... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Let, let's, let's get rid of that sucker. You're, you're too far out of the way, sir. We're, we're focusing on Central Hyrule right now. I, I got kids to feed. That's a lie. I do not have kids to feed. Yamio Shrine. The final shrine in our conquests of this episode. I liked the last shrine. It was kind of fun. Oh, whenever there's green on the map, my, my white shirt goes kind of crazy. I only to remember that. Maybe not wear a white shirt next time I record. It's not that big of a deal, though. Combat training. Throwing. Oh, good. Stocking me up with some fire things. What is it going to want me to throw? We love combat training around here, right, guys? The shrine purifies the blah, blah, blah. Heed my instruction. Yeah, yeah. You were cool the first time. Aim true and throw the material. Are you actually going to fight back this time? Your other attacks are ineffective here. Ready yourself. Of course I gotta try shooting an arrow at him. Select material from your inventory to throw. Hold. Okay. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. Figures. So it's giving me lots of fire fruits here. So it was... Oh, I can select? Okay. Interesting. Nice! Okay, that that is new, is it not? I don't think we could do that in the last game. How long does it take you to say, well done? Watch the enemies move it carefully. Oh, so it's teaching you how to lead my shots. Okay, fair enough. What, what else can I throw? Does, it, does this home in? If I do this? <laughs> okay, uh... Can I get that back? <laughs> no. Please. Ugh. No, my last key's eyeball. Okay, I'll select another material to throw. I mean, I might as well just throw these. I don't I don't really have enough of any of my other material. Ow! I don't have enough of my other materials to really be using it. Come on, buddy. Come on. Ugh. So it wants me to lead? Boom! That's it, I guess. What is that on the ground right there? You have proven your mastery. Now proceed to the innermost chamber where there's a final boss I'll have to throw stuff at? Hmm? No, it's just the end. With a treasure chest, though. We like treasure chests. What is this? Zonite sword. Oh, did he drop this? I bet he dropped this. The the dude. Uh, goodbye, rock hammer. My kitty's here. Kitty, would you like to say hi to the YouTube audience? No. Okay. Dang. Ignored by my cat. My cat's too bougie for you guys, I guess. Oh, unless. Come here. No. Okay, that's fine. I have to pretend like I don't care and then he'll come up. Also very sad that my... Oh, there's a ladder! Saved! Oh, my kitty is here. Hi, kitty. Say hi to the YouTube audience. Aw, cute kitty. Hello. He has no idea you guys exist. Appreciate that. Love that for me. Okay, uh, I think we will teleport back to the um, lookout landing. Let's move my mic back there before my kitty so rudely moved it. Uh, we're going to tell...
teleport back to Lookout Landing and acquire our fifth heart. I think we'll go up to like six hearts and then we'll move into stamina. Because four hearts seems a little low. I, I think six hearts, I don't, I don't know, it's just kind of an arbitrary number that I picked, but I think six is a good amount. And then once we move forward with that, we're going to spec into stamina a little more. Kitty, I love having you here, but I don't really know where to put my controller. I'll just shift over to the side. Oh, and now you're not happy and now you're all over the mic again. You silly guy. Let me cook, kitty. I'll give you your attention in a sec. Ugh. Yeah, he does this thing where he headbutts affectionately. When I think it's when he wants attention. Where's the statue? There it is. Statue of the goddess Hylia. Here are my words. You, I have four of the things you want, and in return you will give me life force. Heart container, please. Yeehaw! We have grown one heart stronger in our quest to uh, find Zelda or something. Oh, now I have cat hair on my nose. I can feel it. Kind of itchy. Heart container. Big. We grow ever stronger. So yeah, with that, that's going to be it for today's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you again in the next one. Take care.